Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make these delicious spicy baked mussels. So let's get started with the video. We're going to begin by cleaning two pounds of mussels. Begin by rinsing your mussels with cold water. Then with a knife, scrape off any barnacles or excess algae that are on the shell of the mussels. After cleaning the shell, next we're going to clean the inside of the mussel. Open up the mussel and remove the foot and the beard. The foot is the brownish looking thing I just poked at, and the beard is the thing next to it that looks like hair. Next, cut off the black sack. Once you removed everything from the muscle, give it a good rinse. Repeat this process with the rest of your muscles. By the way, other than the beard, you don't have to remove any of the other stuff inside the muscle if you don't want to. It's completely optional. That's just the way I like to clean my muscles. When you're finished, give your muscles another good rinse just to make sure you've removed everything and that they're clean. When you have finished cleaning your muscles, set them to the side. Next, in a bowl, add a half a cup of Kewpie mayo. One fourth cup of sriracha, and one tablespoon of minced garlic. Mix everything together until well combined and then set your sauce to the side. Next, place all of your mussels onto a baking sheet. Then spoon the sauce over the mussels. When you're finished, place your mussels in the oven at 350 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Next, we're going to make the scallion sauce. In a small saucepan over low heat, add 3 tablespoons of canola oil and 2 tablespoons of minced garlic. Cook the garlic for about 2 minutes or until fragrant. Next, add two cups of green onions. Give everything a good mix and then cook the green onions until they begin to wilt. Once the green onions start to wilt, add one tablespoon of fish sauce and a half a tablespoon of sugar. 
Then mix everything together until well combined. When you're finished, transfer the sauce to a chilled bowl with ice on the bottom. Then set your sauce to the side until you're ready to use it. When your mussels have finished cooking, let them cool and then place them on a plate. Next, garnish the mussels with the scallion sauce and you are all finished. And this is the finished result! These mussels are good and easy, so if you're looking for a new seafood recipe, this will be perfect for you. Alright, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Everything I used in this video will be down in the description below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!